So, um, this is what my hair is looking like. Let me just show you the length so you guys can get a good idea on how it's growing. It's nice and healthy. And um, I'm really enjoying it. It's easy. It's nice for work. I get up in the morning most days and I slap it up into a high ponytail on the top. And I slap, I use, um, oh, I must have left that somewhere. But I usually use one of those um, oversized um, scrunchies, also AKA headband. And it's the little thin black ones. I usually um, put the hair up on the top of my head in a high ponytail. So while I'm working, you know, I can use my stethoscopes pretty easily, get them in my ears without having to fight through hair and slinging and doing all of that. You know, I like my hair up and away from my face while I'm working. Plus it's nasty. You don't know what you're coming in contact with at work and you can carry it right on home on the tips of your locks as you leaning in. So with that being said, my favorite go-to is a high ponytail or a high bun. And when I put my hair in a high bun, um, I secure it by basically tucking the ponytail under and securing it with a head net, a hair net. And any stray pieces, I usually just stick pins in there to kind of, um, you know, keep everything in place. And it works really good for me. It's easy, it's quick, and I don't have to think about it, which is excellent. <laughs> so with that being said, that's my segue into nursing, which is, <sighs> it is a love-hate relationship at this point. I absolutely love what I do. I love the lives that I touch. I love everything about being a skilled nurse and, and being an oncology nurse. It makes my heart melt when I see great stories of people who have healed or recovered or, you know, coming out of surgery for resections and, um, you know, all types of things. But at the same token, it is very challenging emotionally. Um, I go to work most days and I hardly ever leave on time. I used to um, count that um, as me being a relatively new nurse, but I realize now that our unit um, just unfortunately has a, high, a higher acuity, in my opinion, of patients. When I get pulled to other units, I leave on time, bottom line. Um, but we have high surgical needs and a lot of emotional needs for our patients as well because they are struggling and battling with cancer on a day-to-day -day basis. So they require a little bit more attention and affection. So um, not including all the drains and incisions and surgeries and walking them and rehabbing them and getting them ready. We've seen high pec surgeries, lung wedge resections, chest tubes, JP drains, um, the whole nine yards. And for once um, in my nursing career, I don't feel at a total panic when I'm at work, which is wonderful. Um, so with that being said, um, nursing is coming along just fine. I um, feel like um, this is my calling. This is what God has called me to do. And I believe that when I leave at the end of the day and my patients hug my neck and they tell me that I've been the best nurse and I've been very concerned about their well-being, that makes me feel good as a human. Like bump the money, bump what friends and family might think or say. That right there is worth every single aching painstaking step that I take up and down those hallways each day so that's what's going on in the world of nursing for me um, just wanted to give you my little hair update and maybe I'll update you and show you guys some pictures um, when I come back from vacation show you me sitting in the sand with my coconut drink ready to ride and um, that's pretty much it guys so it's been real um, have a great one stay blessed deuces